Hi and welcome back to Blossom Schoolhouse. Today I'm going to review a curriculum for you. The curriculum I'm reviewing is the Masterbooks Math Lessons for a Living Education Level K. Picking the right curriculum for not only your child but you as well because you are the one that will be teaching from it after all can be really difficult and time consuming and um, so that is why I wanted to give a detailed look at this curriculum. One of the best and most helpful ways to find a curriculum is to see inside. I know that I have looked on YouTube for lots of curriculums, I've watched flip through videos, I've listened to people's reviews, I have trawled the internet for peaks inside of curriculums that I've been considering because you never know what you're buying until you see inside. So I thought I would give my review on this curriculum and a flip through an up close look at the lessons, the layout. So let's start by talking about Masterbooks. Masterbooks are a Charlotte Mason inspired curriculum. This is the math lessons for a living education. So it uses stories and pictures to engage the children while they're learning. It's a foundation math curriculum. So it's building the knowledge of the concepts that will be used in the levels that will follow. So level one will be following from level K. So they're building those foundational concepts before moving on to the more difficult levels. There are 36 total lessons in this curriculum and as I showed you before, those lessons are divided into weeks. So you have 36 weeks, each with their own lesson and then five days worth of activities. So depending on how you spread out the lessons will determine how quickly you finish the curriculum. This curriculum teaches very simple math concepts like counting to 10, learning the numbers 0 to 10, shapes and sequencing, there's the seasons and a lot of critical thinking activities. So let's take a look inside. This is the scope and sequence. So as you can see, there is a lot of repetition and that is what Masterbooks is all about. Repeating simple concepts until the children have mastered them. So we have using this course, we have a description of the course and how mathematics can be taught as a living subject. Next, we have the material list for each lesson. Next we have the suggested daily schedule. At the beginning of each lesson, there is a short story introducing the week's concept. Then there are five exercises for the week divided into five days. So each lesson is for one week. So you can see, lesson two, we have a short story to read. It is always about two characters called Charlie and Charlotte. Then exercise one. And then we have the next exercise. And then the next exercise. Four. And then five. And then lesson three. So it works very much the same. A short story introducing the concept and then different exercises to be divided into a five day week. So this curriculum is aimed at ages four to six. So that means you can use this for your four year old, your five year old or your six year old, depending on which level they are at. But I would suggest that this is a really, really great starter curriculum for introducing math to, yeah, four year olds, five year olds. It is all the basic concepts. It talks about seasons. There's lots of critical thinking, which I loved. The pictures 100% engaged my daughter's attention every time. She was always interested in what was going on and what she had to do and how it applied to the pictures. And she really did enjoy the stories as well.
When you get to lesson 10, your child's introduced to their first number of the week, zero. And then throughout that week, they're going to practice that number. They're going to be tracing it and learning the value. And then the following week is number one and it continues through to nine. By the end of the curriculum, they are learning left and right, a lot of critical thinking, above, below, on and off, opposites and object placement, missing numbers and even patterns. So that is the math lessons for a living education level K. As I said before, we have actually used this curriculum and genuinely really enjoyed it. It was definitely my daughter's favourite part of her school day. She did this alongside the foundational phonics from masterbooks also a couple of things to know are it doesn't feature any addition or subtraction and i believe that is solely because it is a charlotte mason curriculum and the charlotte mason method is all about the early years being learning about the world around them and using their senses and just experiencing life learning and then I believe from age six and up then they bring in more math facts. So with that being said the second thing I want to say about it is that the lessons are very gentle, they are very quick, they don't take much time at all and you may find like us that uh, the child is more than happy to do more than one lesson at a time. My daughter actually asked to do multiple lessons at a time. And the last thing that I want to mention is that it is a faith-based curriculum, but that doesn't mean that if you are secular and you don't want faith curriculum, that you can't use this. You can definitely adapt it. The faith part is not incorporated in every single lesson. It is only briefly mentioned in some of the stories. So if you're not a Christian, but you do like the look of this curriculum, you can definitely still go ahead and buy it and use it and just skip that part of the story or adapt it in your own way it is very very adaptable apart from that all i can say is that we did actually really like this curriculum um, both me and my daughter enjoyed how gentle it was and if you have a child who is maybe age four and you're considering a curriculum or book work but you don't want them to be overwhelmed this is a great place to start because as i've said very simple, very gentle lessons. They're not going to overwhelm you. They're very easy to teach. It's an open and go curriculum. You open, read, do the little lesson together and it's nice and short and sweet. Thank you for bearing with me through that review. I hope it was helpful and I am here to answer any questions whatsoever that you have about this curriculum. Just leave me a comment and I will be sure to answer all of your questions.